Hello, 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 hello. It's been a while, hasn't it? And I've got loads of Dolly Mail, which has been sent as gifts to me recently. So I thought the best way and the easiest way to show it is just to do it on a video. Um, and also I've made a slight effort today. So I thought, oh look, send me okay for a video. I say slight effort, still got sweatshirt on. Um, but you know, it is what it is. But unusually, I actually have quite a lot of my Barbies out at the moment, you can see uh, behind me. That's not normal. Um, uh, it's just one of those things I've been doing something recently. And so I thought, make the most of the backdrop whilst they're out before I box them back all up again. So without further ado, uh, my first gift mail came from Winda at Budget Shop Dolls. And Winda um, is just the most generous person ever. She makes the most beautiful doll wear and exactly as her name says, the prices are low so that everybody can afford them, um, if you're spending that is. And she sent me some goodies, so I wanted to show you um, because you can't always show the entire detail in a post. So just get on with it, Claire, stop mumbling and rambling. Uh, so first of all, she sent me this beautiful two-piece set. It's absolutely gorgeous. Now, I saw this fabric on her page before she'd made some dresses out of it. Uh, but it's just absolutely gorgeous. Um, apologies in advance for the hands. Um, a, no nails, and B, um, I'm starting to get back that problem with my hands with, um, it's called something random, like erythromyalgia or something like that. Um, it's kind of like a combination between really cold hands, having chill blains, um, and then this other condition. So that's why they look unsightly and red at the ends. But do you know what? Can't be bothered with gloves. It is what it is. Um, it's not contagious, so don't worry, you can't catch it through my video. Uh, anyways, yeah, moving on. Uh, beautiful two-piece set, which is absolutely gorgeous. Really easy to put on, elasticated waist, but I just love that fabric. I have got some posts coming up soon where you will see this on uh, my mini me. So thank you for that window. Now I did team it up with this little belt that she sent me, which is just absolutely gorgeous. They're so detailed, really, really well made because I have um, not exactly the lightest or most delicate touch um, and it's dead easy to put on. The little buckle doesn't come off lovely little purple belt so i put that on that outfit and then the second outfit is this which is just gorgeous so it's another two-piece set um and she's even left her little budget shop dolls tag on it which i'll show you in a minute but it's like the most amazing sort of animal print cartoony fabric with this lovely net uh overlay and then a beautiful bodice style top with this teeny tiny little label with a barcode on it's so cute once you see it it's just so cute as i say ignore the nails but just how lovely is that how lovely is that it's really sweet so that's two piece set um i've also got another two piece set oh my days how gorgeous is this and it's a little fox print it's beautiful and it's lined as well so it's got the most beautiful detail on the neckline i don't know if you can just see that but like a different fabric on the inside it's absolutely gorgeous, really easy to put on and off, um, lovely fox print, so thank you so much for that window. Um, and she also sent me some shoes, but she sent them in the most amazing little box, which is branded with Budget Shop Dolls on it. Not only that, it's got detail on the side, which shows you what size of Barbie they fit. That's amazing, absolutely, I love little boxes. And the other side as well with a little Barbie head and a shoe. I just love boxes and look at the printing inside. It's so detailed. And in that came, um, let me just find them now, this pair of shoes, um, which were some black stilettos that she makes, um, I believe they are 3D printed. And so according to the size of the, the box, these are for petite babe, beautiful black heels. But I just love the box. The box is just adorable for dioramas and things. Should do a shoe shop window, that would be cool. That, I reckon I've got enough shoes to do a shoe shop. I just need sort of shelves. Um, and she sent me these, which I believe are for tall Barbie. And I don't have very many pairs of shoes that fit tall Barbie. So thank you very much for those. They're sort of giving me gem and the hologram vibes. What do you think? They're very cool. Um, so they are beautiful. And I think with these and the others she sent me before that I got out to show you, which were curvy shoes, 
if they actually fit the vintage Barbies. And even though they may be a tiny bit too long, they stay on because they almost like clip into place. They're brilliant. Um, and she does these uh, in various styles and colours for all different sizes of Barbies. Super affordable, beautiful fit. They do not come off. So they're brilliant for outdoor photography. So I wanted to show you those. And another pair, which she sent me previously, just because they're amazing little mules. How gorgeous are they? And I don't think I've shown them on video before. So I just wanted to show you those little mules also made by Winda at Budget Shop Tours. Um, and I've still got um, Minnie Colin dressed in a uh, head to toe Budget Shop Dolls outfit. I have taken his belt off. But again, I just wanted to show you because I've had quite a lot of nice comments on Facebook about this top that Winda made, which is the Gouche or Gouche Uh Very cool jumper. And these gorgeous jeans, which have got all these beaded detail on. They're just so cool. So I teamed that up with a Burberry Knot belt, which I thought, again, looked really good, made by Winda. It just really sort of finished the outfit off. So again, that will be shown soon on my page because I've done the photos for it already and little Zach although the top isn't made by Winda this was a top made by um by um by a, a super lovely lady and I always get the account name wrong because I can't say it properly but I want to say Puppin Clyde von Seelen um, but if I get that wrong, I apologise. And she's got another account, which I think is, is it Silent Dolls or Silent Dolls? Um, and she is in the Philippines. But I have this top on because I teamed it up with these amazing jeans, again, made by Winda Budget Shop Dolls. And the jeans are stretchy material. Love the turn-ups. They're just so cool. Um, and I thought it looked well with that little cool Tommy Hilfiger uh, jumper on Mini Zach. So I, I will tag all this below anyway. But I was coming on to say thank you, Winda, for all of my amazing goodies, beautiful outfits. Um, and not only these outfits did she send me, she sent me uh, the belts, the shoes, some accessories as well. Look at this. Boom! Been a while since you've heard that, hasn't it? Uh, a lovely little entertainer bag. It's so cute. So I can fill up with loads of mini brand toys and things. I love it. It's ace that. So thank you for that, Winda. And some little magazines. But they're not just any little magazines. Okay, so they open up, which is very exciting. This one's Vogue and it features Winda's picture on the front. Um, but as you go through, it's got a picture of Winda there behind the scenes. Uh, and also, when Winda came to see me in Blackpool, which I just thought is so cute. So our little meeting that we had um, and some pictures that we took with our minis while we were together, which is just so adorable. And then a picture of me taking a picture. And then on the back, it says Blackpool Memories 2023. How amazing is that? So Winda, that's just so thoughtful of you. Absolutely gorgeous. I love it. And then this other little one, which is Glamour magazine. Oh, yes. And if you can read French, it says... I'm assuming it's French, maybe it's Italian. Uh, I'm terrible, um, to be honest, at any other languages. I think all I ever learned to say was Je m'appelle Claire. French for you there, know that one. And what was the German one? Um, my name is Claire. Yeah, hi, my name's Claire. Uh, so anyway, it's just an amazing little magazine. They're so detailed, finished off beautifully, like the laminated as well, they're amazing. So Winda, thank you for those and thank you for the thoughtfulness of that one from our doll meet. Um, and these, now there are two, I've just not dropped one. I'm using these in a diorama at the moment, which you'll see soon. Teeny tiny Amazon gift cards, oh my days. So they are just adorable. So if you had a shop, you could almost stick these by your till point or as I'm gonna do, use them in a diorama. They are amazing. Thank you so much, Winda. I'll put those there so I don't lose them. And these, oh my days, it's, it makes me want to open them. <laughs> She's put something inside them so they look like proper mail. They've got a teeny tiny stamp on, a little address, proper envelope. I love these. Again, for dioramas, they're amazing. A post office diorama would be ace, but um, I'm not entirely sure I have the things I would need for a post office diorama. But it's a great idea. You don't see many of them, or I haven't seen many post office dioramas on eBay. But for Valentine's, these are brilliant. Could be some cards in there. And last, but by no means least, boom, look at this. Oh my days. Winda has made this by hand, the most beautiful little bouquet. And look at the flowers. So they're made from paper, 
but they are so detailed, absolutely gorgeous. So thank you so much for that window. Absolutely love it. Love it, love it, love it. So thank you, thank you, thank you, Winder, Budget Shop Dolls, also my exotic doll for the drama um, and all that jazz. Yes. I'm going to move on because I've got more mail. Uh, this package arrived. Oh, it seems like ages since I said package. I'm so excited getting mail. Um, as I say, these are all gifts. The second one, though, is actually a prize. Now, I did win this prize from, and again, I hope I pronounce this correctly, uh, Anya, and her account is called Baron Ike's Klein Welt. Now, again, I hope I pronounced that correctly, Anya. Um, I won her giveaway, and I'm going to open it now and show you what I've got. So it says, I wish you lots of fun with your prize, dear Claire, because she knows I already have an idea in mind for what I'm going to do with this. So beautiful little gift card there on the front. So thank you, Anya. Beautifully wrapped up in some lovely paper that I will save and use for like a gift wrap for Barbie. And I can't believe I'm doing a video again. I'm well excited. That's sad, isn't it? I've actually found time, A, to make myself look semi-presentable, B, to have a bit of a backdrop, uh, and see to just be opening amazing gifts. Oh my days, this is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so I'll show you the back first. It's a little cutting board, but the excitement in the miniature doesn't stop there because wait, are you ready? Wait, wait, wait. Boom, boom, look at that. Oh my days, hand painted by Anya. A beautiful one six scale cutting board, which I cannot wait to use in a diorama. I already have a cake in mind that's going to sit on top of this that's been waiting ages uh, that my lovely, lovely friend from another account made and that's Elena and Elena has the account called Fun With Dolls and if you have a look she makes miniatures, mostly miniature food but absolutely amazing and I have a cake ready to go on that but just look at the detail in that, I've got shaky hands, shaky hands uh, it's just the most beautiful little birds on there and then a gorgeous flower in the middle I just don't know how anybody has the skills to create something so beautiful. So, Anya, thank you so much for my beautiful gift. It will be used soon in a diorama, and I will link her account below so you can go and check out the other beautiful miniatures she makes. She has previously made me some beautiful gifts, which you've probably seen. Uh, a little embroidery cushion with a dash and on, which is hiding somewhere up there. Um, and some beautiful, uh, a beautiful rug. Um, and a wall hanging, so I will have to show you them all again soon in a diorama, but thank you, Anya, for the absolutely gorgeous little cutting board. Almost too good to be cut upon it. Um, so I will pop that away. And last, oh, but by no means least, I had some mail arrive yesterday, uh, which I've taken out of the envelope now, and it has come from the beautiful Victoria. Now, Victoria is an account owner that I have followed since I first joined IG, I think, uh, on Dollstagram. And again, so I don't get it wrong, it's Dolls Fashion House Vita. There are some dots in between. I'll link it below. Um, and she makes beautiful clothes. And previously, when I was buying, um, I was able to purchase items from her. Some of the most beautiful lingerie I think I've ever had came from her. And I've not opened this yet. And she sent me this amazing gift. So, um, let's dive on it. Oh, the bag full of goodies. Oh my days, what is this? Oh, how lovely is that? A beautiful little box, but shaped like a dress. Oh my days, that would be gorgeous in a diorama. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I love it. That would be good for like a wedding dress shop. Um, I'm just going to open it. There may be nothing inside it, or there may be, but either way, it's still a beautiful little box. And it's got tissue paper inside it. Oh my day! Oh my days! Oh my days! I saw this on her page and I absolutely loved it. So pink tissue paper. I always love a bit of tissue paper. Oh, this is gorgeous! And I have the perfect Barbie ready to put with this. So it's a tiny little bag. But are you ready? <gasps> Huzzah! It's got mini mouse on it. Oh my days! It's gorgeous. And I don't know if you can see, but I've got ready. I have to watch the camera angle because I don't want to look like a fatty. Uh, at the end here, Disney Fun Barbie waiting to come out of a box and that is going to be perfect. So I reckon you can either wear it as a shoulder bag, crossbody or even a bum bag. Oh, but it matches um, some socks that I got previously from her that have got tiny Mickey and Minnie's on. 
That is just adorable. Can you see it there? Again, ignore the fingers. That is just the cutest. I can't wait to get that on. And as I say, perfect Barbie. Thank you so much for that. I absolutely love it. That's so cute. Uh, and my little box, which I will tie back up again and that will be used in a diorama. How cute is that as a gift box? That's gorgeous. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my days, there's loads in here. Oh, oh my days, this is gorgeous. Look at this. So it's packaged as an outfit set in a bag like that. How amazing is that? Oh my days, and her little branding sticker on there. This is beautiful. Oh wow, these are gorgeous. Oh, look at those flared jeans. How amazing are they? So it is a jean material. They are beautiful. And they're kind of like a grey colour. Um, I love the flares, they are so cool. With this amazing top, look at this. I love the neckline on that. So I think you can actually probably wear it either way, either that way or, boom, look at the detail on that. Teeny tiny buttons. Beautiful white sort of cotton material with a little bit of stretch in it, you know, so when you've had one too many pies. That is gorgeous. So that with those, and it also comes with its own little bag. Oh my day. It's like a little leatherette bag. Oh, it's got a little, um, almost like a key ring on it with a tiny little heart. Oh, that's gorgeous. So it's a pink leatherette bag with a tiny little dangly heart, which is gorgeous. These will all be available to purchase, I am sure. Um, and, oh, it's just gorgeous. I love it. I love that so much. So thank you so much for that little three-piece outfit there. That is gorgeous. I love it. I feel like it goes with a beret. What do we think? A little beret just to finish it off. And, oh my days. Okay, one second while I get the last thing out of the bag now. Oh yes. And obviously, uh, the bag. Extremely useful, you know. Those days when you're feeling like it's all too much. You know, oh, calm yourself down. Oh yes, a super useful bag. Also, free Claire's breath. We know that people want Claire's breath. Oh yes. Moving on. Anyway, just being silly. Uh, the last little package of delight. Again, with the beautiful little branding stickers. Beautifully packaged. <gasps> what did I just say about beret? Oh my days, and I genuinely had no idea what this was. Thinking on the same wavelength. Oh wow. Beautiful, beautiful. Hand painted wool art. Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh, that's lovely there. Ready? Boom. It's only the Eiffel Tower. Or it could be a very fancy black or tan. Oh, I'm joking. So I have it there. I have the whole look ready. Beautiful for a trip to Yay Paddy. And I think I have a beret somewhere in my hat's drawer. Um, but look at that. How detailed is that? Absolutely gorgeous. Original art for my Barbet's wall. So that is going to be a diorama. That is a whole vibe. I've got to go finding all my french things uh love it i think i've got some french things and obviously emily in paris new season coming soon uh so that's very apt so absolutely love that love my little bag which will be going on a um disney barbe uh and beautiful little gift box so thank you so much victoria again hope i've pronounced your name correctly and your account name dolls fashion house vita absolutely love you and what you make uh, and I'm so sorry I can't physically support you at the moment but I hope that just in sharing these things that people will go over to your page and have a look at your beautiful outfits um, and accessories and art. So Victoria thank you, Anya thank you and Winda thank you so so much for all of my wonderful gifts. I hope you've all enjoyed the video, I've loved being back. Um, yeah so until next time thank you so much.